Good morning, Street Corner Don here. Uh, keeping you up with what I'm up to, I've been holding a sign that says, uh, we are all one. Of course, when they go to donaldmarks.com, they get to see what I mean by that. And so I'll have to come up with another sign for next week as I continue to try to provoke people to go to the website, learn more about Jesus. And, you know, I've really wanted to buy some more signs, but I don't have the level of donations to do that right now. But I thought, well, that'll come when it comes. It came last time. Uh, but what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go uh, with what I do have, you know, what I do have enough money for. And so I'm working on uh, creating a mailing list, basically. It's a, an email list. Found out that I don't have to use MailChimp or cost, Constant Contact. My website actually includes that kind of thing in the package, uh, uh, email management. And so I can create that, something that uh, will send itself out automatically, like on Friday. I can just work on the draft during the week, what goes in it. And I'd like to do that, you know, once a week, something that just reminds people of where they can find me because social media is well, kind of unreliable. They are pretty random about what it is you can talk about. There are things that they do suppress. There are people that they suppress. Even Tim Tebow got suppressed by Twitter. So, you know, rather than have myself at their mercy, I'm going to try to spread it out to a lot of different places. And one of the best ways you can find out where I am currently is if you sign up for the mailing uh, address, the email list. So I haven't got that up yet, but it will be up pretty soon. And uh, the next thing that I'm going to do, since I want to promote that email list, is I'll get some business cards made that have the same kind of motif as the sign, you know, with the where it says donaldmarsh.com at the bottom, I'm trying to come up with a spiffy name for it. And it will invite people to go to the website and sign up for the mailing list to learn more and to be kept up with what the you know, weekly sign is, things like that. Then what I'm going to take do is I'm going to take those business cards. You're going to like this. <laughs> and every week, I mean, every day, well, you know, like three days a week right now, I stand out on a corner holding a sign. Well, I'm going to hold my sign near the local high schools. Now, the school's back in session. And each of these schools have a fair amount of foot traffic from the surrounding neighborhoods. And I'll pass my business cards out to them, encouraging them to go there and learn about uh, you know, what it is that I'm doing. And uh, then every week they'll get an email reminding them of what's happening. And, you know, this is the only chance a lot of these kids will get to hear the gospel. So uh, I expect some people will not like this. And that's good in a way. Uh, <laughs> because that's what the gospel is supposed to do. The gospel is good news. But not everyone likes good news. They don't like the ramifications of the good news. And when you go around telling everybody, guess what? Your sins are no longer being held against you. There's always somebody sticking their finger up in the air and going, well, wait a minute now. Uh, you know, we have a big movement going on in this country right now about being guilty. How important it is that you recognize that you are guilty. You're part of an evil system that oppresses people. And they want you to, you know, bow your knee to that. And that's just wrong. We only bow our knee to God. And instead of embracing the guilt that people are trying to shell out, we should be turning it upside down and saying, no, you've been set free. You are not guilty of those things anymore because Jesus took your sin away. He took your punishment. So it's kind of a short one today, but I just want you to know what I'm up to. Realize that I don't like the, the grass to grow under my feet. I always find something to do. And that's what we should be. We should be opportunistic and looking for opportunities to get the gospel out. And so I use my website and I use my signs and soon business cards. And of course, when I'm handing out those cards, it gives me a chance to engage more people than when I'm standing on a corner holding a sign. So uh, this is a Street Corner Don. I'll be on a street corner near one of the local high schools soon. And I thank you very much for supporting me. Go, go to streetcornerdon.com and you can um, basically you can support me there as a pro subscribe star. And I think what I'll do is I'll put uh, some links underneath this video to go with it. 
You have a great day.